Well, hey guys, it's Justin. I'm back here at the Magic Kingdom for another fun day and wanted to bring you along for the ride. I just wanted to check out the park and see how things are looking overall. So if you're up for it, join me for another fun day as we explore the park together. Friends, if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, you can do that right now by clicking the red subscribe button below and then click that notification bell. That way you're notified every time I release new videos like this one. If you like this video or find it helpful, click that thumbs up icon below and share it with someone else that might like it. Finally, and most importantly, if you need prayer for anything, you know I'll pray for you. Just drop your request below. All right, just as soon as they open up that park, we'll jump inside and start our fun day. Let's get to it. All right, at 716, we're through security. Let's see what the fastest way to the park will be. Monorail or ferry boat, make your wagers now. All right, guys, the express monorail is actually running, so we don't have to take the resort monorail and stop twice before getting to the Magic Kingdom. All right, it's 7.33 and the express monorail just dropped us off at the beloved Magic Kingdom. Let's jump in a line. All right, at 7.45, we're in the park. Let's see what awaits us first. Good morning, Cinderella Castle. Looking sharp, just like I remember. Does anyone else think the castle looks a little naked without the 50th anniversary decorations? Let me know in the comments. All right, it looks like the Castle Hub popcorn cart got a paint job. No more red and yellow. It's white and blue now. No more Mickey colors, I guess. All right, guys, per usual, I'm gonna rope drop the Jungle Cruise in Adventureland. Looks like I'm the first one here. All right, the rope has been dropped. Let's get to the Jungle Cruise. Welcome in, Roger, head, Roger, step in. We're actually like so very clear. Yeah, to go into the jungle. I have an idea. 
Yeah, I'm going to close. You are too. Well, I'm closing my eyes. You keep your eyes open. Sounds good? Tell me if anything happens. Yeah, I'm closing my eyes now. Raise your hand if you didn't make it. I'm so sorry, guys. <laughs> I'm really sorry. It's okay, though. Because we are now in the Indian Elephant Bathing Pool. Guys, duck, guys, duck, guys, duck, guys, duck, duck. Over there. <laughs> oh, I saw that. I'm sorry. I really like ducks. They're just really cute. They're so cute. Sorry, that was embarrassing. We're going to keep going. Hey, guys, look, the monkey right up there. He's going to take our picture. Everyone get ready and say cheese. <laughs> guys, I'm just kidding. He's not taking the picture of you. He's doing oh, it for the exposure. <laughs> I got you so good. Oh. Now, get out. <laughs> All right, just wrapped up with the Jungle Cruise. Thank you, Skipper Alley, for a hilarious tour around the jungle. Now I think we'll hop right next door to Pirates of the Caribbean, as I usually do. Jump in line for that. Arr, here be our sea vessel, matey, for front row. Hey, friend. Nice hat. Talk about a bad hair day. My goodness. Maybe try some conditioner now and then. Okay, it just got really dark and kind of bumpy. We went into a little cave. What's going on down here? Whoa! <laughs> Hi, Barbosa. Nice ship. Thanks for having me over to your lagoon today. Hey, Carlos. Are you still keeping quiet? You're a tougher dude than I am, I'll tell you that. Don't be chicken, Carlos. We need you to stay strong. Hey, Jack. La Cantina? Are we back at Epcot? Glad I don't live here. All right, Parts of the Caribbean is in the books. Another walk on. Let's see what's next. All right, guys, I landed boarding group number 15 for Tron this morning, which got called at 8:45. I have until 9:45 to return, which is in about 10 minutes. So let's go jump in line. We have made it inside the building. Users, prepare to be digitized into the world of Tron. Oh, Alright, Tron is in the books. It was 45 minutes to get through the queue. Let's keep walking around, see what's next. Alright guys, I think we'll head on over to Seven Doors Mine Train next. 75 minute wait for that. Not great, not terrible. Let's go jump in line. Oh, hey, Tigger. He is heading to his meet and greet. Oh, I want his energy. Have a good day. All right, guys, here's our mine train. We are very front row. All aboard. And we're off. All right, Seven Doors My Train is in the books. It was a 55 minute wait. Now it's up to 90, so definitely hit it at a good time. Let's keep walking around. All right, heading back to Tomorrowland now. The park's pretty busy today. GD Plus was $22 to buy, but feels busier than that. All right, I think we'll jump in line for Buzz Lightyear Space Ranger Spin. 25 minute wait for that guy. Not too shabby. Uh-oh, an alien's loose. Stitch, where are you going? 
He misses his attraction, that's the problem. He doesn't have a home anymore. Have a good day. Hey, sir, we're coming to get you. Oh, you think I'm kidding? Okay. We'll see. I don't like that you can't pick up the gun in this ride. That's where Disneyland's ride is better. There's supposed to be a white ship worth a lot of points in this room, but I never can find it. What did I say, Zerg? Told you you were doomed. Bye, Buzz. All right, let's see how we did. 850-400. Cosmic Commando. All right, Buzz Lightyear Space Ranger spin is in the books. It's a 35 minute to get on the ride, so it's pretty backed up. All right, see what's next. All right, guys, the people mover's a walk-on. No brainer. Let's go enjoy that. All right, we're on one of my favorite rides of Magic Kingdom. And we are accelerating. This is the TTA Blue Line, non-stop service around the world. I like this ride because it's relaxing. You get a bird's eye view of Tomorrowland. Just get a good feel for how things are looking without walking around. All right, a 10 minute wait for Monsters Inc. Lap Floor, which means that's just waiting for the current show to get out. Next station is I highly recommend that one. Urban planning and Star Transfer to green and red the Castle Hub looks busy as always. Express train keeps on rolling Speaking of the, the castle, future. good morning. Two of my favorite spots. Walt Disney's amazing dream for a community of tomorrow. Oh, I want to live there so bad. Did you progress in the inspired Epcot? And a lot of the visionary ideas throughout Walt Disney World. Look, there's even a tiny people mover. It's probably why Epcot's my favorite park. Now approaching Tomorrowland Speedway. There it is. Tron Light Cycle Run. I love a good circuit. And these are two of the best tracks of the cosmos for a bit of light speedy competition. What a beautiful day it is. About 84 degrees right now. Sunny, a few high clouds. Great day to be here. Now approaching Space Mountain. That was down when I checked earlier. Let's see if it's back up. Sounds like it's operating. Let relaxation wash over you at the most refreshing retreat in the galaxy. The coral rooms of Icy 7. You H2 owe it to yourself. Book today. Thank you, Mr. Morrow. Mr. Tom Morrow. Please contact Mr. Johnson in the control tower to confirm your flight to the moon. Hi, people in the other people mover. When do you think Tomorrowland Speedway will convert to electric cars? My goodness. To your right is the Astro Orbiter, our celestial symbol of interplanetary harmony and fellowship. Hop aboard and launch high above Tomorrowland for a spin amongst the planets. Hey, we just wrote that. Whether you have one eye or nine, there's the money shot. The to see this show. My fellow sentient life forms, our people move their journey has nearly come full point. Thanks for riding with us. It's been a pleasure to have you. This feels and like about a $25 Genie Plus day, not $22. Because now is the time. Now is the best time. Just my opinion, to though. To go out and explore tomorrow. Today. See you in the future. See ya. Here's the People Mover line now. We hit it at a good time. We're having good luck today, guys. It's because you're with me. All right, guys, we're crisscrossing the park back to Frontierland to pick up some lunch at Pecos Bill. Let's do it. All right, guys, here at Pecos Bill, I picked up my staple, the Sun Bonnet Trio salad with chicken, of course. Nice, light, refreshing fare on a warm day. I'm going to add some Tabasco, hydrate up, and we'll see what's next. All right, lunch at Pecos Bill's in the books. It was delicious as always. Now I think we'll head on over to Peter Pan's flight, a 55-minute wait for that. Not great, not terrible, but let's knock it out. No outdoor queue, that's a good sign. Let's get the Neverland. Yeah, I'm just looking at the wait times right now, standing in line, and they're pretty high. Space Mountain is at 90 minutes, higher than Mine Train. This is a pretty busy day. 
And again, Genie Plus was only $22. Just proves you never really know until you're here. All right, guys, change of plans on Peter Pan's flight. Right when I was about to board, the ride went down, and I waited there about 10 or 15 minutes, but it did not look like it was coming back up, so no need to waste any more time. I called it. Now I'm going to head on over to Monsters, Inc. Laugh Floor in Tomorrowland, catch some laughs and some AC. Let's do it. Uh, welcome. My name's Buddy Boyle, and I'm one of the jokesters here at the Laugh Floor. Do you all know who your monster of ceremonies is today? I'll give you a hint. It's Mike Wazowski. The more you laugh, the more power we collect. The less you laugh, well, we may not have enough power to open the exit doors. <laughs> Hi, Mike Wazowski. That's Wazowski with one eye. Wazowski, you better fill the can this time, or else. Or else what? <laughs> Or else this. Well, my name is Jeeves. This is my little brother Mac. And Mac is an expert in geography. Geography of the human world. Monster world. What human what? world. What is this? I've been studying very hardly. Um, shout out the name of a country. <laughs> oh, that's a good one. I have Canada. Capital of Canada is C. Yes, hello. Well, what is your name? Shiloh. Hi, Shiloh. Where are you from? Oh, Florida, Florida, okay. Florida, of course. Um, uh, known for being a enormous volcanic iceberg floating off the west coast of the cliffs of lasagna, and it's famous for the Eiffel Tower. Okay, okay. Uh, is that right? No. No. <laughs> Thank you very much. Uh, I'm so sorry. No, I, no, didn't no, no, I don't blame Shiloh either. I blame the. The Florida school system. Let me try again. Uh, Woodyear, Arizona is known as the land down under. It's famous for kangaroos, mounted police, the majestic yak, and of course, the Eiffel Tower. Okay, hold on. You just said the Eiffel Tower from Florida. It's a franchise. They're everywhere. <laughs> This one has a Bass Pro Shop at the bottom. It's great. It's really What you might not know is that I'm a mind reader. That's right. I'm telepathetic. What is your name? Morgan. Correct. <laughs> it's just a sample of my incredible psychic powers. Huh? Morgan, I want you to think of a number between 1 and 50, and I will read your mind. Do you have that number, Morgan? Okay, great. First thing you should do is tell your number to the entire audience so everyone else will know when I get it right. But don't worry, I will not hear you because my eyes are closed. Now, make a sound of telepathetic mystery. Go for it. <laughs> oh, I thought um was your telepathetic sound. I thought it was... It's perfect. It's, it's, um. okay, it's working. I've read your mind. Your number is 35! <laughs> I don't know how I did that. It's like it, it's 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 like it just hit me, just out. Of it. You know, Uncle Mikey sent me out with some great jokes. You all texted in. Unless you want to hear some, say, oh yeah. yeah. Awesome. The first one I got came from Caitlin. Caitlin is from Alaska. Thanks, hey, Caitlin. Caitlin says, "What do you call a fake noodle?" Everyone say, "What?" what? An impasta. Look at that. We did it! We killed the kid! Wonderful! <laughs> what do you think of that, Ron? Well, I guess I have to promote the one responsible. Oh, yeah, what's my new title? Not you, Wazowski. That guy. Alright, just finished up with Monsters Inc. Laugh Floor. Always a good time. Improv comedy is my favorite type of comedy. I highly recommend this attraction. Alright, let's keep walking around, see what's next. All right, guys, my salad has worn off and I've worked up quite an appetite laughing so much. Let's grab a snack. All right, guys, I stopped by the Plaza Ice Cream Parlor and pro tip for me to you, don't eat here right when the parade ends because it gets so busy. I grabbed this right before the parade started and there was nobody in there. But I picked up the ice cream cookie sandwich with cookies and cream ice cream. I even got a side of the peanut butter sauce. I highly recommend that upgrade. All right, I'm gonna thoroughly enjoy this and we'll keep walking around. All right, guys, who's ready to tackle the wildest ride in the wilderness? That's right, we're heading to Big Thunder Mountain Railroad, a 55-minute wait. Haven't done it, though. Let's knock it out. 
All right, guys, here's our wildest ride in the wilderness. We're row number 12, almost to the back. It'll be pretty wild. Hang on. You're welcome. Howdy, partners. Howdy. For your safety, remain seated with your hands, arms, feet, and legs inside the train. And be sure okay, to watch your kids. If any of you folks are wearing hats or glasses, yep. remove them, because this here's a wild. All right, Big Thunder Mountain's in the books. It was a 45 minute wait, a little under the posted wait time. What a wild ride that was. Well, I thought we were at Magic Kingdom, not Animal Kingdom. I guess he gets around. Don't forget about the applause boxes they have set up at Disney World. Everyone's famous when you get in the square. No one's ever mad about being applauded, no matter how old you are. It shows how self-centered the human race really is. Well, guys, it looks like they have a hula hoop farm set up here in Frontierland. I don't know that I'd pay all that money to come to Disney World to play with hula hoops, though. That's just me. All right, guys, as wait times continue to soar, I'm heading out of the Magic Kingdom now, but thank you so much for joining me today. I hope you had a great time and got to see what the park looked like. It was a pretty busy day. It definitely felt busier than a $22 Genie Plus day, more like a $25 to $27 day. So just keep that in mind. You never really know what crowds are going to be like until you're here. Well, friends, if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, you can do that right now by clicking the red subscribe button below and click that notification bell. That way you're notified every time I release new videos like this one. If you like this video or found it helpful, click that thumbs up icon below and share it with someone else that might like it. All right, everybody, until next time, stay well, stay safe, and God bless. Bye for now. I have manifested thy name unto the men which thou gavest me out of the world. Thine they were, and thou gavest them me, and they have kept thy word.